magnets attract each other where the south side of one magnet attracts the north side of another magnet so you can end up with a stack of magnets and get a stronger magnet than one all by itself. But also magnets repel each other if they are in opposite directions. So this magnet is actually floating on top of the magnet here because I have reversed their magnetic field so I have a north opposing a north. And then I can continue and put more magnets on top. If I use an, one that's a repelling, you notice it compresses. This one now has more force on it because it's this magnet is holding up the weight of this magnet and the weight of this magnet, and it takes more magnetic force to hold up more weight, and you see it as these magnets falling down. And I can continue to do this by adding more magnets, always alternating them. And you see that to hold up one magnet, you, you need this much distance. But to hold up two magnets, you need that distance. To hold up three magnets, that distance. To hold up four magnets, that distance. So what it says is the magnetic field is stronger when it's close together, and it's weaker when it's farther apart.